All right, YouTube, so I'm not sure how widespread this story is because it's not even 24 hours old yet, but there is a video going around of a guy who's pretty much destroys the inside of a GameStop because they won't allow him to return his copy of Fallout 76. And this is mainly due to policy. If you don't have the receipt, you cannot get your money back. The best they can do for you is give you store credit, which is, I'm pretty sure, the policy for most places. If you don't have a receipt, like, they can only ever give you store credit, and you're lucky if some places will even do that. Now, we don't know for sure why he's wanting to return the game. Maybe he just didn't like it, didn't know it was going to be multiplayer, online only. Maybe he played it and was bored. Who knows? But for whatever reason, he wants to return his copy of Fallout 76, and they won't let him. Now, we're going to play the video in its entirety. It's only like 40-something seconds. For me, it was kind of hard to make out what the guys are saying, like, back and forth between each other. So I end up using some headphones, which I recommend if you want to hear what they're saying. But it does get kind of loud once he starts destroying the store. So you've been warned, I guess. I want my money back. There's nothing that I can do about it. That's just their policy. Like, it won't even come back in as a return to a brand new game. That's when I scan your receipt, it's going to see when this one was bought, and it's going to automatically give you trade credit. How you doing today, sir? So as you guys can tell, this guy's pretty upset that he can't get his money back on the game. But I think most people know the return policy when it comes to pretty much any place. You have to have the receipt to get your money back. I don't know of any place that you can just walk in with any game or any item and be like, you know what, I want all the cash for this item. You almost always have to have a receipt or it's going to be store credit. And if he's a gamer, I don't see why getting the store credit wouldn't be an issue. Like if he gets his full $60 back for Fallout 76, like there's plenty of games out there that you could buy right now. I don't know what platform the guy's on, obviously, but he could have walked around the store and found a couple of games or one brand new game. I don't see what the big issue is really. And let's be completely honest, who doesn't keep their receipts when they buy a brand new game? Like, that's kind of crazy to me. I always keep my GameStop little bag that they put the game in with the receipt in the back. I always keep that handy while I play the game to decide if I want to keep this game or not or if I want to return it. Like, who? it's your fault for not bringing the receipt in. Like, let's be honest here. Normally, we like to shit on GameStop. Pretty much everybody does. It's a meme. There are bad a lot of times, but it's pretty much a meme to shit on GameStop these days. But in this particular situation, we're kind of forced to side with GameStop. You just have to. And I absolutely love the employee in the situation who kept us cool the entire time is trying to inform the guy. Like, that's their return policy. Like, I'm not the one doing this to you, man. It's GameStop's return policy. And as the dude's destroying the store, he walks out knocking over shelves. He just answers the phone like, Hello, this GameStop my name's Brian. How can I help you? Like, just kept on going about his business. Anyways, kind of a shorter video, but I wanted to share this with you guys in case you had not seen because it's a crazy ass story. In regards of your thoughts on GameStop or Fallout 76, the only bad guy here is this grown ass man throwing a temper tantrum like a little kid. I'm not 100% if there's legal issues here. I'd assume there would be some level of like destruction of property or something like that. So the guy can probably get in trouble for this. His face is on camera, obviously. Like, just take the store credit, man. Even if it pisses you off, you can bitch about it. Just take the store credit and leave. Like, why cause such a scene and probably get yourself in trouble? It's just, it's just stupid. Anyways, as always, guys, leave your thoughts below on this story. I'm sure a lot of people out there have been this mad before with GameStop. A lot of people hate GameStop, but luckily not many people tend to do this, or at least we don't hear about it if it happens. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Turn notifications, follow me on Twitter at TheDashingDavid, at my Discord. Links to my social networks are in the description and in the outro. Later, guys. Because, yes, Fallout 76 is entirely online.